whose idea was it to fit that room to capacity with hoes? With girls? Another story from two years and a half ago. We did the podcast. You know, we got the studio. It's going good. It's a little bit of traction. I bring mm -hmm. some guests in that I met from going outside. But then I'm like, we need some more pizzazz. We need something that's going to yeah. pop, bro. Yeah. Something that's going to go viral. Nobody in this space really brought girls on to talk about dating like that. Yeah. I mean, a few people brought them on here and there, but not consistently. And I was like, this is something fresh. This is what really happened. Late night, we were on a double date. We had some drinks, went out, whatever. We go upstairs to the studio and we're just sitting there talking. He's with his girl, I'm with my girl. And then I was like, it's like what, 11 at night? Bro, we don't wanna go party. What should we do right now? I say, yo, Myron, crazy idea, bro. Let's go live. Let's go live. Let's go fucking live, bro. <laughs> And I'm like, let's just fucking do it. He's like, you sure? I'm like, why not, bro? What do we got to lose? Let's just do it, bro. He's like, fuck it, let's do it. So then we go live, bro. We're seeing the most raunchy, like crazy shit. It was and, so bad. And you just met those hoes. Yeah, literally. Right. Right. <laughs> right? And it was so crazy that we had to put on Patreon. What's the name of this? It was like two girls, one table, I think. Two girls, one table. Yeah, right. it was hilarious. Right. 